Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So this, this is the detailed review for BTEC and MTEC courses in NIT Suratkal and this will cover the complete placement details and the other information. So NIT Suratkal is one of the top notch uh, uh, engineering college and NRF ranking was 12th, right? So it is better than many of the IITs also. And this is the college which is located on the sea beach and it has its own private beach and place is very close to Mangalore in Karnataka. So as you can see, it is the scenic campus and at the same time provide all the modern infrastructure as well as required. So I'm not going to cover campus too here by my focus is only covering the placement details about the college. So first I will start with the NIRF 2024 data which is the latest placement data available by government you know and if you can see it shows the last three years performance so for the 2021 batch right 782 students were graduating on out of which 642 of them got placed with the median salary of 10 lakhs and in the next year in 2022 passing batch 837 students were graduating and the placements increased to 734 students getting placed and you can see the median salary is 12.84 lakhs quite excellent and the next year like in 23 passing batch right 903 students were graduating and the number of students placed is also increased to 794 close to 800 students and you check the median salary it is 15 lakhs median salary which is quite excellent and better than most of the NITs as well so the top table was for the BTEC course and the down table is for the MTEC course. So for MTEC also the placements are quite excellent. You can see 578 students were doing MTEC and out of which 436 got placed in 21 and the median salary was 9.35 lakhs. Next year also similar 577 students got placed in MTEC course median salary increased to 9.42 lakhs and last year around 580 students of mtech got placed and the median salary also increased to 11 lakhs so both the courses mtech btech are excellent and this is, should be on the very high you know, priority of the students so let's move now this is the breakup of the placements for 2023 and i have taken from the college newsletter so it's all authentic information and if the similar data which I showed for the 2023 batch like BTEC 796 students got placed with 92.9% and for the BTEC course the highest salary was 54 lakhs and median salary from the NIRF data also I showed you 15 lakhs. Average salary is even higher 18.26 lakhs. And same thing I showed for MTech also, right? And uh, which is 12.64 lakhs is the average salary and median 11 lakhs. Highest salary for MTech was 38 lakhs. <laughs> and if any student is seeing from MCA, MCA is also good. 54 students were eligible in MCA, 54 out of which 51 of them got placed. And uh, again, percentage of MCA placement was 94. And maximum salary for MCA was also 38. And the median salary of MC is excellent, 13.59 lakhs. MBA, again 43 students were there, 31 of them got placed, 72% is the placement. Maximum salary for MBA is 9.83 and median 8.1 lakh. So MBA is not a good option to study in NIT Suratka. Now I am presenting the branch wise placement of 2023 branch you know, so that you should know which branch you should opt or you should opt for any other NIT. So this was updated by college by 30th of June 2023 and the first branch civil 90 students eligible 67 got placed 74% placement. Chemical engineering, 50 students eligible, 50 got placed, 92% placement. Rest of the branch you can check here, CSE, EC, electrical, information technology, even mechanical engineering you can see. In mechanical, 178 students eligible, 165 got placed with 92% placement. And even the metallurgy, right, 38 students were there, 36 of them 
you know got placed with 94% and mining also 44 students were there 40 got placed with 90.9 so all of the branches have excellent placement maybe a little bit civil engineering is at the last spot but other all branches are having almost 90 plus placements and up to 100 percent placement same I will leave for the MTech branches, civil engineering, water resource and chemical engineering and within this there are sub specializations so you can see here the number of uh, you know, students eligible versus the next column number of students placed and the percentage placement which is there in the last column so you can check on your own. Moving to MTech for the computer and the it related branches right here also you see 95 to you know, 95 to 97 percent placements in computer science side and electronic side also 85 86 to 93 percent placements in different branches and information technology 100 percent placement mechanical engineering also every branch got 87 88 percent placement so all quite good and you can take on a deep look into this even the lower branches uh, from MTech side like metallurgy, mat material science, mathematics, computer science, all of these are also showing good trends. So placement percentage is good. For MBA, MC, I have covered earlier and these are more detailed information. So that's all I have to cover in this particular video. And thanks for watching. If you like that, please uh, like the video and subscribe channel. I'll cover all the NITs, triple ITs as well. Take care and bye.